Hey guys, I just bought the Tesla charger. So I bought this so that I don't have to go to the supercharger and charge it every time I can do it from home. So this is a box, it's actually pretty big. This is how it looks like the charger. Uh, I'm gonna open this up, it has not been opened yet. Uh, and I'm gonna show, going to show you guys what's inside. So stay tuned. All right, so let's go ahead and put this bad boy down. Okay. So this is pretty big. I'm actually surprised how big the box is. I didn't think it was gonna be this big. Um, like the charger itself, I think it's pretty small. It's like this size. So yeah, I think what's really big inside is the wiring. So that's why it's such a big box, but let me just show you guys. It's pretty cool. Like you can carry this with one hand, but it is pretty heavy. So this is how the box looks like. And then let me show you guys the back. This is how it looks like, it has like the T. But yeah, this is how it is. And uh, <laughs> this is really cool, it says here, made on earth by humans. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Okay, awesome. So let's put this down and let's open this up now. Like this. Okay, we're gonna cut the tape. There we go. All right, let me turn this around now. All right, so time to open up the wall connector. Let's go ahead. Okay. Oh, wow. <laughs> this thing is huge. Oh, wow, let me take it out of the box. Oh, wow, look at this. <laughs> this thing is heavy. Oh wow. Uh. <laughs> okay, so it has some wires in the back. I think I have to open up the entire thing from here. Let me try to open it from here. Oh, okay. So here it is. Let's remove the wire. Look at this. Oh, I can't even turn it. <laughs> this is so big. Okay. And it's like, oh, oof, this thing is heavy. Oh, okay, this is what you get inside. Oh. <laughs> All right, so this is how it looks like. This is the Tesla charger. This thing is huge, okay. Uh, this is where you put in the the piece for the charger And yeah, this is how it looks like it's pretty heavy um, And inside the box they gave you a manual. This is how it looks like Okay, and then they also give you this piece here. Not sure what this is for Okay, so this is how they show you how to install the charger, but yeah. Oh, there's a huge message here. It says uh, Thank you for Accelerating the world's transition to sustainable energy. And then it has that in different languages. It has that in, I think, Spanish, in French. Merci d'avoir accéléré la transition du monde vers l'énergie durable. So in French too. Uh, oh, it also has it in Arabic, or I think it has in Urdu. Pretty cool. It has it in Chinese. It doesn't say which languages. Um, I can just tell by... Um, yeah, just by reading the, uh, yeah, the, the text. Okay guys, so this is how it looks like. It's pretty cool, right? <laughs> it's pretty heavy. So this is how we're gonna install this. Let me move this on the side. Ooh, heavy box. Put this down. Okay. Oh. <laughs> All right. Okay. So, now that this is here, okay, so this is how it looks like. Let me go ahead and open this up. Do I need my tool? Yes, I do. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and open this up. Ah, I just hurt myself. Okay. Okay, so this is a charger for Tesla. 
Um, this is how it looks like. It looks like they put some oil here to make sure that it stays, um, I don't know. So yeah, it seems like there's oil here. Um, and over here, this is actually a button for the remote. This is when you want to lock and unlock the car once it's charging. So they have the button here. So pretty simple. This is how it looks like. Uh, let's look at how long the wire is. So let me cut these, uh, let me cut the tape here. Put that in here, keep it organized. Okay, so let's go ahead and see how long this can go. <gasps> okay, it's actually pretty long. <laughs> it's all tangled. <laughs> okay. That was close, it almost fell down. Brand new thing, I don't want it to fall. <laughs> okay, so as you can see, it's pretty long. I can't really tell how, how long. Okay, so this is how the charger looks like. This is where it gets the power, it lights up, and this is what goes inside the car. So you can uh, you can put this inside the car, the charger. So um, yeah, so this thing. Uh, now let me give now let me give you guys the the breakdown of how much this costs. So I paid uh, seven hundred and fifty dollars for this charger. That's Canadian. So U.S. it might be around like six hundred or maybe like five fifty. And so this was sent to me. I bought it directly from the Tesla website. And um, I'm lucky because where I live, the government actually gives me a rebate. So, uh, and I'll explain to you how the rebate works. So I purchased this, right? I had the receipt that I purchased this. Um, so that's my proof. But for me to get the rebate, what I need to do is I need to have it installed at home and I need to get a receipt. Uh, it needs to be a certified electrician. Once that electrician installs it, um, and gives me a receipt, then I can take that receipt, I can mail it to show proof to the government that I installed an electric charger at home, so, um, and then I'll get a rebate, and that's $600, right? So this was $750, I'll get a rebate of $600, so this will only cost me $150, which I think is pretty cool. So let's actually increase the price. Before this used to be $650, so, it would have only cost me $50, but now they increased the price an additional $100, so it's gonna cost me an additional $100. So, um, so yeah, this thing costs $750, and then the installation itself, right? I, I've been speaking to a few people. Uh, some people have been giving me a price of $1,200, some have given me a $1,500. Um, there's a, a company that I spoke to, they gave me the, uh, they were giving the charger and they were doing the installation together. They were charging $2,200. And so I asked them, hey, uh, are you able to, uh, you know, take the payment with my American Express credit card? And there's a lot of companies that don't accept that card. So when I was speaking to the rep, she said no, right? So then what I did is instead of paying the full payment directly with them for the installation and for the charger, which is $2,200, right? Instead of paying them directly, uh, I bought this with my American Express credit card because Tesla does accept it. And the benefit I get is I'm able to uh, get, you know, credit card points for purchasing this charger. So I got points, I'm going to get a rebate. Uh, and now for the installation, I'm going to ask, you know, and see if anyone uh, is able to accept my American Express uh, Platinum credit card. Um, so if someone is able to accept it, you know, I'm going to be more inclined to do it with them so I can get points, right? If they don't, I'll end up paying it. But yeah, so the range of the payment is anywhere from $1,200 to $1,500 approximately. Um, let's see if I can, you know, get it more toward the $1,200. And once that's done, uh, I'm going to make another video. I'm going to show you how the process works of actually getting it installed because it's not as simple. The process is actually very very bad 
Um, all the five companies that I've spoken with, they ask so much detail for you to install this charger. You need to take pictures of uh, where it's being installed. So the outside, like the driveway, um, they ask you to measure, um, like if you're going to install it from the outside or the inside in the, like, so they want to know if you're going to install this outside in the garage or inside in the garage. And then they want pictures. They want the measurements, how much uh, it's going to take, how much rope it's going to take from the electric panel because they need to attach uh, this to your electric panel in the house. So they want measurements, how, how long it's going to take from your electric panel to this charger. They want that in feet or meters and uh, so they want pictures and they want measurements. So it's not very easy uh, for someone who, especially who doesn't know how to um, you know, take these and you're doing it for the first time. It's actually a, a challenge. Um, it was a challenge for me. Uh, it's not a very easy walkthrough. I would love it if someone just like, you know, um, yeah, if just someone could just like walk me through or just do it themselves, but it's not, they want you to do all these steps. After you've done all these steps, then they give you an estimate um, so yeah, let me talk, talk about that, right? So I, I was talking to all, all these different companies and they were telling me uh, if you want an estimate, you need to go and through all these steps that I just mentioned. So you have to get all the measurements, you have to take all the pictures. Um, and so there's like about 10 to 20 questions they ask you online you need to submit just for an estimate. And some of them don't even give you the estimate, they just take your information and then just store that info. Uh, I actually complained to a company I was like, like, you know, you went, made me go through and, you know, I had to put on a jacket, go outside, it was winter, it was cold, I took all these pictures, you said it wasn't enough, and then you told me uh, to take more pictures, so I went, took more pictures, then you asked for measurements, I went, I took all the measurements, so did all that work, and that company just said, oh, we don't service in your area. <laughs> so, it was a, a waste of time, you know, uh, and so just be careful, uh, I would ask them before, doing all these steps if they actually service in your area so you save time. So that would be one tip that I would give you. Um, yeah, so that's it guys. So I just unboxed the Tesla charger. This is how it looks like. I think it looks pretty cool, pretty clean. I like it. I think this is a glass. Pretty cool. Uh, hopefully, I, uh, I've seen this outside, uh, you know, for the weather. Hopefully this does not get damaged outside protected i know electricity and water it doesn't mix really well so hopefully you know they thought of that and uh yeah so i'm going to speak to these companies find the best price and then i'll show you guys how the installation works and the process you know uh, how we measured it and how we actually get the installation done and then i'll give you guys the final price in our next video uh, once you know once everything is paid and then I'll also give you guys you know how much rebate I got and also you know I'll uh, explain to you guys the convenience of me now charging this at home compared to charging it at a supercharger so I made a another video how much it's costing me going to the supercharger if you haven't watched that video make sure you do and then guys that's it this is the end of the video I hope you guys like this and stay tuned for more and like the video if you liked it, uh, comment below um, if you liked the unboxing or if you guys want to know more about the cost of like um, anything related to Tesla products, let me know in the comments below and I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Peace.